All right, what is up, ladies and gentlemen? It's VMP. Welcome back. This time we're here with a little boy Prisno, and uh, today we're gonna have some fun. This is gonna be a big ass battle that we're starting this episode off with, because Zeladek, the Chosen One, just spawned in, and uh, I don't know if I've—I think I mentioned this last episode actually. Um, if you beat him, you get to uh, capture his sword, Skyfall, which is. One of the best, if not the best, one-handed sword that you can get in the game. Um, and I wasn't planning on finding him or being able to take him out anytime soon. But then he spawned in, and he only has 600 troops. And looking at them, yeah, he's got like 60, 60 Ilkathalki Knights, 76 Ilkathalki Rangers. But, what, the rest of them, about 460, are kind of just shitty Ilkathalki units. Real soft ones. So... I don't know if we're going to be able to take him out with 160 troops. We are outnumbered about 4 to 1. Um, but we should be able to at least make a good dent in his army. And honestly, we have so many fucking troops right now, we could use to lose a few. <laughs> and this would be a, a worthwhile battle for them to uh, for them to sacrifice themselves for. Okay, Zeladek, surrender or die. 596. Um, the question is, what kind of battlefield do we want for this? Okay, this is... No, nah, no, this isn't, that's not very flat at all. Okay, here we go, this should probably do. I've got entirely heavy cav army right now. I don't have any of our Drakenmeisters, of which we have 53. 53 Drakenmeisters. It's pretty impressive. Oh, I, I can already see him. I can pick him out of the crowd. Let's see if we can snipe him, actually. Get the fuck out of here, there he is. Oh, he's kind of moving through, where'd he go? Holy shit, yeah, look at all, all the Ilka Falky kind of look the same. Where did he go? I want to find him. Alright, we'll pick off a few of these guys for right now. Oh, okay. Apparently our horse was getting killed. Can we ride... Brown Bandit horse? Ah, I guess we can. There we go. We're up. Where is he at? Where did he get off to? Alright, hello. I might have to move around a little bit. Do some scouting and try to find him. That is, if he hasn't been taken out already. I hope he hasn't, because I want to use Skyfall for this battle against his own troops. I feel like that'd be kind of poetic. Alright, let's uh, go ahead and drop our first heal for our troops right now. This is going really well. The Ilka Falki, Light Cav, um, they're not doing so so good against our Reich Heavy Cav. Um, normally, they might have an advantage because they'd be able to run away, but we have so many cavalry units, and actually, they have so many that they can't really run away and escape. Everybody's getting kind of clumped up. It's, it's a bit of a mess. <laughs> this is a very messy battle. Um, but hey, that's what we like. Dwarves like to get dirty, just a brawler. Oh, we can actually ride their war horses. These should actually be pretty fast. Let's see if we can't find... Honestly, he's probably... Okay, he's probably knocked out at this point. That's too bad. How much, uh... I didn't even look at the beginning of the battle. How much renown are we going to get for this? I feel like we should get a decent amount. Hmm. I'm not sure. But I figured... <laughs> Actually, I wasn't really sure what I was going to do for this episode because I wanted to do the Red Immortal quest line, um, but we can't do that until we either make peace with Drahara or uh, um, take over, what, Amarna, I believe is the city that it is. And uh, I don't think we're going to be taking Amarna out anytime soon unless we get named as Marshal and we can uh, get some lords to follow us. Which, by the way, I wasn't even like really looking for it, but apparently the lords have been voting for us to become the new Marshal. But uh, Kaiser Odo uh, go is going against what all the lords want and actually choosing other people. I found that interesting. I'm not sure why he's, uh, I don't know, if he just doesn't trust us because we haven't been with him for that long. But we've been doing work. We've been, we're have been we the only ones that have been keeping the Reich alive at this point. We wouldn't even have the capital of the Reich, Murdenhall, at this point if it wasn't for us. I'm just going to put that out there. He could be salty about that, though. He could be salty that we now have his ex-town. Uh, yeah, okay, I can kind of understand why he'd be mad about that. I mean, that's, I'm pretty, like, 95% sure that's not why he's uh, giving us the uh, the role of Marshal. I don't think the game takes that into account, but who knows. Yeah, this is still seeming to be going pretty well. Have we healed up our troops anytime soon? New enemies just arrived. I mean, we're not really getting worn down by attrition too much. I just don't think the Ilka Falki have enough damage to really break through our, our heavy armor. I just don't think they got it. Their bows, I mean, their bows haven't even been hurting us. And I don't think... I think our troops have better armor than we do, to be honest. Alright, this horse is about to go down. Switch it out for another one. 
There we go. Full health. Perfect. There's so many of them. Yeah. I mean, we still got to go through 600 of them, cause, so we're not close. Not close by any means. Um, actually, we've been, there's a lot of green on the side there. We could actually be getting decently close, I suppose. Uh, can we drop a heal for everybody now? Hey, there we go. Okay. Yeah, shit. We haven't really been losing all that much. This is going very well. God damn it. I was, I was hoping we'd lose just a few troops. They're down to their just Ilka Falki riders at this point, so that's their weakest units, right? Because I want to say the Hunter was the mid-tier unit. So they're down to, like, their what? Their last 140 units now? Oh, man. This is going by real quick. Real fucking quick. So, guys. Um, <laughs> I, I expect some of you guys might be a little bit, little bit mad that this wasn't an episode of Prophecy of Pandor. Uh, for those of you that haven't seen it, I don't know how you couldn't have, um, we released the four, first four episodes of Prophecy of Pandora in a single day. Uh, because what I did was I was like, alright, as soon as one of these episodes reaches 100 likes, I'll release the next one. So once I know enough people have, have seen the, uh, the episode and they were digging it, okay, I can go ahead and release the next one. I was planning on maybe getting through three. Definitely wasn't planning on going through four. And what ended up happening is we went through four in, like, the first couple hours. The first video took, like, an hour, hour and 15 minutes to get 100 likes. And at that point, I was like, alright, sweet. Put up the second video, and I was like, this one's gonna take a lot longer, though. Because people are gonna be busy still catching up watching the first episode. So I went to the gym. Because I was like, sweet, I can get a workout in. Like, 45 minutes later, I check my phone, and the second episode already has 100 likes. I'm like, god damn it, guys. And, like, there are comments like, Come on, VMP, you said at 100 likes we get the next episode. Hurry up, man. I was like, I, dude, I thought I had, like, an hour, hour and a half at least. Not the case. Um, and so that, yeah, that went all the way up. We got four episodes in. And uh, I was considering doing a fifth one for Saturday, um, which might still happen. Um, but then I thought, you know what, we had four episodes in a row of Pandora. I want to get out a uh, Perizno episode because I know a lot of you guys love Perizno. I fucking love Perizno. Um, and just for, you know, a change of pace for a little bit. And then we'll definitely have one, definitely have another Prophecy of Pandora Sunday at the very latest. We'll see how it goes tonight. I might be able to record another Prophecy of Pandora. The problem is, like, it's already one, uh, after one. So, I don't know. We'll have to see. Boom. Got them all done. Zeladek. Spare me, I am the chosen one. You would not like the wrath of an entire Ilka nation upon you. I'll spare your life, but I'll be taking your treasury and your very fine sword. Oh, 5,000 orms and Skyfall. Oh man, I'm excited. Okay, by the way, thanks to whoever uh, reminded me that you can do control all or control A and capture everything at once. That's going to speed shit up so much. Like, you have no idea. We've been spending the last couple episodes just going through, like, uh-huh, capture, 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 up to, like, 110 at a time. So, yeah, that's gonna speed things up incredibly. Ooh, what do we got going on here? Holy shit. Okay, um, I guess our troops can't even hold it. Hold up, so here's Skyfall. Oh, man. Fell from the sky as a meteorite. Forge in the Fire Mountain by Sky King. This is the Sword of the Chosen One. Look at this! 58 swing damage, 52 thrust damage, 105 speed, 145 reach. Good god, that is almost an unholy amount of damage. Oh shit, we are about to wreck with this thing. Like, this is about to get ugly. Oh, I was gonna actually give this to one of our troops, but uh, there's not enough space. I forgot. Holy shit, I can't wait to try this out. Skyfall. Alright, alright. Let's get back to uh let's get back to our lands. Get back to Mernhaw. For all for all we know it's back under siege. Are you kidding me? Did they take did Drara take Desalocked Castle back already? Are you fucking kidding me? It's under siege though. Are we taking it? Oh we are taking it. Oh yeah, there's a new marshal. It's not it's not Herzog Oscar anymore, which is kinda too bad because when he was marshal he was out and very active, uh like fighting. Um, and so that's why he got taken out so much, and we were always able to, uh, get his, um, get his Drakenmeisters, but that's not going to be the case anymore. Alright, Garrison, give me as much as you can, thank you very much. Ooh, got an eighthling in there. Um, alright, yeah, fuck, let's just sell this off. 
Ooh, Mystic Merchant's bag. Why does the Mystic Merchant always appear here? I mean, I love it. This is our town, so it's great. Oh, 19, 19 grand, not too shabby. Alright, gave me this. Oh, whoops. Gave me all of them again. Um, I think. Tell you what. We'll go ahead and actually leave the Grand Chieftain in here. Um, yeah, we'll go ahead and leave him there just so that uh, he doesn't escape from us. Because I believe, even though I don't know if we have a prison, I don't think we have a prison tower here in Murden Hall yet. But I still think he's less likely to escape uh, than when he's in our party. So, we'll keep him there for right now. Uh, let's go ahead and sell off the rest of these. Might even... Might even pay the Mystic Merchant a visit. I'm feeling... I feel like, look how long this thing is! Oh my god! Alright. Alright. What do we... What do we... I mean, we don't even need to... Don't even have to worry about a sword anymore. Don't even have to worry about a bow or a crossbow anymore. We're just good on all that. So really all we're looking for at this point is, I guess, armor? But even then, we've got some pretty beastly armor. So it's just kind of horses. Horses and armor. Okay. Well, tell you what. That's going to take a while to find anything good. So we're just not going to worry about that. Um, Actually, I believe we need, we're need. we supposed to go visit our lady friend. So we'll do that real quick. Hopefully her father is not in town. Because he still doesn't know about us. Oh, he is in town. Ooh, he just got taken out. Who did he get taken out by? I'd like to know. Oh, wait, hold up. I think we actually learned a song this time. Ah, sweet. Normally we just come in here and kind of, I don't know, just say hi and then leave. But that's good enough for her. She's happy. Um, do, 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 do you like poetry? It is very worthy and philosophical, but if I am to listen to a bard strum a lute for three hours, I personally prefer there to be a bit of a story. Okay. Okay, well, I mean, we got a little bit of relationship with her. I guess that was... Probably not worth our uh, 300 dinars that we, or orums that we spent on that. Look at, I forgot how majestic his beard is. Torvik's a good looking dude, you guys have to remember that. Oh, by the way, to whoever made the, uh, the Grafen Oga, um, YouTube account, <laughs> you're fucking hilarious, man. Oh my god, it cracks me up so much, because I was joking about that someone was going to make an account, and sure enough, you did. And I think it's probably the same dude who made the, uh, the Ghost Greg account. If you don't get that reference... It's part of the Prophecy of Pandora series. Um, but dude, you're hilarious. Keep it up. I love that shit. Okay. So, that went pretty well. Let's tell you what. Maybe, let's see if we can take a town. Definitely not going to take a suit giant town. Um, learn that lesson. Because <laughs> we couldn't even handle that king, really. Like, that king was tough as shit to try to fight. And um, I can't imagine... An entire town of like 1,200 giants or however many are in there right now. So, would that mean maybe... Uh, Namarna's kind of under that sort of siege, not really siege. Because I don't think the, they're actually really trying to take it right now. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I mean... Alright, let's let tell you what. We'll do a little bit of scouting. A little bit of a little scouting. That should work. Uh, Herzog Oscar wants us to come back and visit him. Yeah, okay, we'll probably, we'll probably say hello. Um, because this is not going to, I don't think this is, this would be our siege army. We'd probably get, like, at least 40 archers to go along with us. Still don't have any Alintoran archers. That's where we're, we're definitely going to want eventually. See, Calvera, nearly 1,500. Um, what, Bulgan, maybe a little less? Although, I don't know if Bulgan's ever been taken out either, so... I don't even know if... Yeah, 1,300. I guess... We'll, what, we'll just scout out all their towns for right now. Um, beside Ulias I mean, that's in, the, that's in the middle of their territory. We're not going after that anytime soon. 1,300 at Crane. Oh, shit. We're actually losing a lot of money. I guess we do have a very elite party on us right now. Normally, these troops are only paying half wages. Um... Oh, and I guess Mernhall... Oh, tell you what, I know what it is. Mernhall isn't making that much money as we saw last episode. The reason it made that much money last episode is because no one had owned it for a couple of weeks. And so everything stored up and we got it all at once. So it's not like 60 grand a week like we thought it might uh, might have been. It's more like 20 grand a week. Okay, that makes more sense. Is this an actual battle going on or what the fuck is... 
What's happening here? The hell? Someone fighting us? Okay, I guess these two dudes are fighting us. Whatever, I can check out. Test out my new... Oh, this thing is so fast! Look at... Oh! You can even just see it go through. Who wants some? Oh, we just decapitated his horse. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, baby. We're not even getting good hits off here. And we're just destroying their horses. Okay, maybe we shouldn't have ran in <laughs> directly into the middle of them. That's fine. The problem... Okay, the problem with it is almost... It's so long that, like, to get a good hit with it, you have to kind of be far away from the enemies. Otherwise, you don't do as much damage. Which is... I mean, kind of a good problem to have. You can just stay at range, but it's gonna kind of suck when we're up close to people like this. You don't do as much damage. I mean, okay, we do a lot of damage still. We're doing just fine. Good God damn it, cavalry! Cavalry! I love that you're saving me, but I do want to get a little bit of experience for myself here, like that. I see some assassins behind me. Oh no, it's just those dudes. Just the regular ones. Here we go. Here's another horse. Tell you what, let's drop a little bit of healing just to make sure none of our dudes get killed. Why did these guys think they could fight us? Honest, like, real question. Why the hell did they think they stood a chance against us? They've got, like, it's not even like they have good units. I fought that, uh, their one vassal again that has all the shadow assassins in between episodes. And, you know, I can understand understand him thinking he has a chance. He didn't, because he fought us when we had entirely Drakenmeisters, and the Drakenmeisters destroyed. We didn't lose a single Drakenmeister, killed every single one of his dudes. Or, well, captured 45 of them, which was worth, like, 30 grand. Not too shabby for a day's work. Get over here. Get back over here. Ugh, there we go. Uh, I guess let's heal ourselves up. Don't mind if I do. Uh, battle's almost done now. Only a few of them left. Oh, we weren't using our crossbow at all. Speaking of our crossbow, I do have... I don't know if you guys noticed, um, but I am building a blacksmith forge in Murdenhall. And apparently what that does is during sieges, you replenish ammo uh, every minute. So that should really help us out, especially if we have like another uh, giant um, siege attack against us. Because we were doing a ton of work with our crossbow, but we ran out of bolts. <laughs> we, we killed too many of them. But hopefully that wouldn't be a problem anymore uh, after th that gets built. And it shouldn't take too long. It was only like uh, six days. Maybe not even that much. Uh, it might have been more like 12 days. I don't know. But not too long. All right. We got... Okay, we're already maxed out there. I mean, Amarna actually has 1,400. I don't understand. What is going on with all these... Leonine? Do you know what's going on right here? Because I sure as hell don't. They're not fighting. Amarna's not losing any troops. They're just... Glitching out, I guess? Oh, look. We can besiege it. I mean... <laughs> do we really want to besiege against... 1600? No. Um... <laughs> no, we don't. This is where we would definitely want to have some, uh... Some backup. <laughs> um... Because even if, even if we had, like, our 50 sharpshooters, what are we going to do against 1,400? We're just throwing away troops at that point. But, I mean, we kind of almost, that, once again, that almost wouldn't be a bad thing at this point. We're spending so much money on troops. Um, hmm. Now that you say that. <laughs> now that I said that. This? You know what? Fuck it. We're doing it. <laughs> I want to do this Red Immortal quest. We're fucking doing it. Let's see if these guys will join us in the siege. If they did, that'd be awesome. Oh, wow, the suit giants are giving us 18 grand for their Grand Chieftain. You can have him back. I mean, he's going to be a pain in the ass when he comes and tries to take Murdenhall. That's fine. We'll deal with him then. For now, take that 18 grand. The defenders sally out to meet your assault. So it's a negative 7 battle advantage. Isn't the best. We get 217 renown for this battle. Just for them, them sallying out? Oh my god, that's a... Wait, I think the Xan are fighting with us, too. I saw some Xan units with us. Oh, the Xan are with us! Oh, this would be great! Oh shit, yeah, this sword is almost... Skyfall is almost too long for this shit. 
We can't we can't hit anybody in close quarters because it's too long. Our sword is too big. All right, there we go. Let's go ahead and heal everybody up. Because this is not where we want to be losing troops at. Okay, our crossbow's not exactly doing all that much. Should we go, go two-handed with Skyfall? See what it does? Um, the answer is not a lot. That's probably because we don't have very good two-handed skill. Oh, man, you just clobbered us. All right, we're taking the shield back out. Oh, we're about to get knocked out, actually. Yep, there we go. <laughs> Whoops. How's our uh, how's the numbers looking? Oh, yeah, we sh oh, okay. Our dude should be fine. We're gonna lose a few, but they should be fine against this. Honestly, this battle's kind of perfect just because we're gonna get 218 renown for nothing, essentially. For essentially nothing. If our dude dudes hold on, I'm seeing a lot of a lot of people dying all of a sudden. But it, I think it's mainly just our allies, not so much us. Are we actually gonna lose this? Come on, guys. Be better than that. 45 against 50, son. We should be good. These guys are putting up a lot better fight than I thought they were going to, though, to be honest. The numbers are getting close to even. Number... Oh, no. Okay, and then just as I say that, we lose a few. Uh-oh. Shit. This is getting really close. It's coming down to the end. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay, we take the lead. And we still have a majority. Oh, man. Okay, 10 on 10. 8 on 5. Okay, they're going to clean it up. Holy shit, that was... That was a lot closer than I thought it was going to be. It was a lot closer. Last one? God damn. I think it was mainly because they had so many assassins. How many assassins did they have? 54 of that 200 that we just took out. No kidding. Alright, let's at least look and see what this castle looks like. Um... Okay. Alright, so it's pretty close here. Alright, we're gonna get out of here. Alright, and then we're gonna abandon the siege. Okay, so I think this is something we could do with archers, though. I think this is something we could do with archers. We just took out 200 of them, and did we get that 200? I think we got 200 renown for that, which is ridiculous. Um, if we could do that every battle, that'd be perfect. Uh, tell you what, let's actually stop down in Fountain Hall, sell some stuff off. Um, I think we might, we might go ahead and pick up some of our, like... Hired Master Archers. Um, yeah, I think we might pick some of them up. And see what we can do against them. I think having all those Ilka Falki with us was actually kind of a dis... Or, er, not Ilka Falki. Um, the Xan were, was actually kind of a disadvantage. Because we didn't have as many troops for ourselves. Um, ooh. Silly Vithiel. Yes. Come with me. She's a very good archer. 8,000 orums. I got that. I can afford that. Ooh, Mystic Merchant. You met, you met us here. Well, as long as I see you, I'll always come in and take a look at your shop, buddy. Got anything good for us today? Not armor? No? A camel? It's not the exotic animal I'm looking for, man. I'm looking for a fucking dragon. Alright, Ransom Broker. Boom. There we go. Thank you very much. Who's this guy? Oh, shit. Uh... Okay, I guess we're going to do this quest. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, rampaging nobles in skill brigands. Sure, why not? Take my boys! Whoa, that's some good-ass armor that... They got the same armor I got. What the hell? That is not what I thought you meant when you said nobles, man. We have two very different definitions. Good God, what are these dudes that we're fighting against, even? Oh, they have some of the Falcon units. Oh, okay, because it's... They're in... They're... 
This is a uh, quest from the Falcon Mercenary guy, the Realm of the Falcon dude. So it's going to have some Realm of the Falcon units, which are the strongest in the game, arguably. Besides Pendor units. Or, not Pendor, Prisno units. There we go, knock him off his horse. Yeah, this guy looks good. You know, I didn't think I'd see myself saying this, but Skyfall is actually, like, too long for us, man. I mean... I guess it's it's fine for while we're on horseback in most situations, but when we're on the ground, it's too big. It's it's like we we ca it keeps on getting caught on other people. Like if we've got more than a couple people fighting us at a time, we can't get any swings off. It's kind of surprising. I don't know. All right, got some loot for me here. Go. Alright. Let's go back and talk to this dude. Let's see. I don't know. Do we even get any... What do we even get for this? Is it just two grand? Because... Two grand is kind of pocket change to us at this point. It's not... That's not really why we're doing stuff. For that, uh... Tiny amount of money. You've... What? What the fuck does he mean we... Sh we failed the quest. How the fuck did we fail the quest? We took care of your rampaging nobles. Were we supposed to keep them alive or something? Were we supposed to just knock them unconscious? There we go. Teach me another poem. I need something new for our lady. She wasn't too impressed with the last one. God damn it, Mernhall just got besieged. That's fine. We're going to head back there anyways. Alright. Hopefully they don't get in there. I mean, we've got 300-some dudes there, so... They shouldn't be able to take them all out by the time we get there. Uh, the thing is, I think we did take a lot of the, uh, Baron Hendrick wants us. Well, dude, I'm gonna tell you what. If you're coming to Mernhall, I'll meet you there. But otherwise, I gotta... Fuck, it's actually, they're actually fighting. Oh, sh... 3,600? What the Fuck! That's not a joke. That's for real. Holy shit. I mean, I kind of want to fight this. Just to let these guys know that they can't do this, but that many? I don't know. Alright, we're doing it. We're going to try to fight these guys. 3,600. Jesus. H. Christ. <laughs> we had a negative 22 battle advantage, and we have like 500 dudes. Is that... How is that possible? Oh my god. <laughs> oh, that's insane. This is actually insane. I mean, we're probably going to lose this fight, right? I mean, there's no way we can take on that many. And in Parisno, it doesn't go for a certain amount of ways. They just go until it's over. 3,600, I mean, dude, there's no way. Get out of here, assassins. Scrubby little assassins in your... Actually, I mean, why does there... Those don't look like assassins, either. Oh, there we go. It's just... <laughs> you can see them when the textures come into view. That's interesting. <laughs> we don't stand a chance against this, do we? But, um... This will be fun, just to see how long we can go. This first wave is gonna suck. I mean, this is going to be almost entirely desert assassins. Um, which, spoiler alert, no, we don't. <laughs> we can't really beat. Those guys are... Oh, crap, they're throwing at us. Two, shit. We might actually... Then we might actually be needed up front. Instead of firing our uh, crossbow, maybe. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh... Count number is 10 to 1 on the battlefield. Guys, I don't know about this. I mean, this is one way to cut costs. <laughs> to lower our, uh, our weekly wage. Holy shit. Okay, well, tell you what. We're going to drop some healing. Nice. Nice and early for our boys. It's a good thing we don't have our Drachenmeisters in here. That'd have been disappointing. Oh, fuck. They're actually inside already. Shit. 
Um, you know what? On second thought, <laughs> we might try to just negotiate uh, our way out of here. Because, I mean, this clearly is not going to work. This is not going to work at all. And as much as I joke around about not caring if we lose, like, our army, I don't... These are all of our Dragoners, for the most part. Uh, all of our Dragon Ritters, all of our Cavalry, um, all of our Nops. So, yeah. Probably don't want to actually... Oh, and we're shooting friendlies. That's good. Always good to see. Yeah, okay, let's get out of here. Can I retreat? Did do behind me? Ouch, just fuck it. Get out of here. Let's get, let, let's just go. 32,000, that's nothing to me. Alright, we're just gonna go. What the fuck? They just immediately attack us? That's not how the... That's not how this works. We just paid 32 grand to get out of here. What the f- <laughs> What dicks? What is this? Are you kidding me? Alright boys, charge in. We're gonna have to kill- Good god, how many of these dudes are we gonna have to kill to get out of this battle? Fuck me, I don't even know. <laughs> Look at that just wave. Just wave and wave after troops. It's like endless almost. Can we try some overheads here to get some kills? Actually, that's not working. And we're off our horse. Okay. okay. <sighs> Damn it. <laughs> I don't see a way out of here. I mean, our Dragon Ritters are killing some of them, actually, surprisingly. Um, we might have to just leave our troops and let them die. Which I hate to say, but... Whoops. I'm knocking over my mic. That might be the best option. Yeah, they're just gonna get, get destroyed, right? We just don't got the numbers. We don't have any numbers. Oh, we can leave what? Yes! Oh! I thought we'd have to kill way more than that. Okay, let's look at our situation. Where are we? In regards to everybody else. We're right here. Okay, so we're gonna run exactly this direction. Ooh! We're gone. We're out of there. Burn Hall stationed with 310 already. Holy fuck. Okay. How much- how long has this episode been going on for? I feel like it's been going on for a while. This? <laughs> is interesting. Um... Fuck, let's tell you what, we're gonna pick up our, uh, Kaiser Lich Dragoners, because we've got a bunch of those still. Where are those at? There we go, 17. There we go, and we're gonna actually get, what else do we want? Hmm. Okay. So we're up to 170. Whoa, when did we get so many prisoners here? Damn. Okay. Some lord must have dropped them off. Donated them to us. Alright, well, I'm kind of pissed off some of these dudes. Ooh, they're fighting wolf knights. That's a mistake. Oh, wait, come on. Let's get in here before these lords... God. Damn it! <laughs> of course of course, he just left the middle of a battle to fight us. Okay, but there's 600 of them this time. This one's actually doable. Probably. <laughs> Probably. We've got... I mean, we've still got our elite army. Still got our super elite army. We didn't lose that many... Actually, like, in the siege, we lost, I don't know, 10 or so. Probably lost another maybe 10 in uh, that, that battle against all of Drahara. Um, so, realistically, yeah, we didn't lose that much. We just lost Mernhal, which sucks. Um, so we were in the middle of fucking... We were probably almost done building that blacksmith, too. God, man. Okay. Well, in the... I mean, once again, another bright point... All of our archers, all those hired archers that we got last episode, they were inside of, um, they're inside of, uh, our other castle. So we didn't lose them. Um, that would've kind of sucked. Honestly, there's just no defense that's going to stop a 3,600-man siege. There's just, you can't beat that. 
when, when Drahara puts that together, you just lay down and take it. Um, fuck, man. I'm, th I'm trying to think of what we could have done. We could have had all the Reich's vassals stationed there, and I don't think we would have won that battle. E like, yeah, even with all of the Reich's units, there's we just wouldn't have won. We have the manpower. Okay, we actually don't want to die here. Um, <laughs> I know that. So I know that sounds surprising. What tactics from VMP? Shit. Okay, well we're gonna die regardless because there's so many of these fuckers. Holy shit! I didn't realize there's so many. That's not what we wanted. Um, I think we got a. Ah. Yeah, I tell you what, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna get back into this battle. Um, just because we need to have our ability, our healing ability that that prolongs the life of our troops so much. Um. I think that's more important more important than getting like the renown that we would have gotten for finishing that entire battle out. So yeah, I think this is the best move. We'll try to be more careful. We're going to stay back this time. Because uh, we've been getting knocked out a lot. Ooh. Get one-shotted. Yeah, okay. The battle's looking a lot more fair this time. We definitely outnumber them a lot more. I still can't believe that. Negative 22 battle advantage. Like, the only time I've seen that is when we have, you know, only 20 troops or something like that. But we didn't. We had 170. Or 160. Plus, there was a garrison of, like, uh, what, 150 left? We had 300 troops, and we were outnumbered. I don't know, what, what would that have been? I'm trying to think. What, negative 22 battle advantage? That's what, you're outnumbered like, uh, 10 to 1? Something like that? 11 to 1, probably? Because I think, I think battle advantage is, well, no, it's weird because of tactics. I don't know. I can't, I don't know how battle advantage works exactly, like the actual numbers of it. But still, negative 22 is a lot. Alright, let's drop some healing for our troops because we're starting to lose a few. God damn, we need to we need to make peace with Jahara already. After we take Mernhall back, of course, but we need to make peace with them. They're just so fucking overpowered right now. Um, we don't stand a chance. We need to regroup and I don't know, probably declare war on what Macavia, maybe. I'm trying to think what uh what faction we'd be able to get some castles from. The Reich would be able to. I don't know. We might not have to worry about that for too long. I don't know how much longer we, we're going to be a vassal. Because, uh, I mean, we've definitely got... We've got the troops to start a kingdom. We've got the manpower. Um, I guess it's kind of just a matter of getting some vassals that would join us. Um, that's the only thing we really have to worry about. But, I mean, as, uh... As you take castles, sooner or later, people are going to come flocking to you. If you've got a bunch of extra land, lords are going to... Lords are going to come after that and want to join you. So, the only question would be, where do we start? <laughs> where do we, uh, start our kingdom? I wouldn't mind finding some of the Zan. And, like, trying to take back some of their territory. Getting out of the north for once. Like, go around the elves, maybe. That'd be fun. I'd like to get some elven archers. If we can get a giant elven archer army. That would, oh man, we'd make mincemeat out of the, uh, or not even mincemeat. Make, we'd, we'd be archers. We'd make pin cushions out of the Zan. Alright, let's try to heal up our boys again. There we go. How many dudes were we fighting against right now? Like 600? Oh, shit. Horse! This way! What is it? T? Whistle for a horse? Where's some troops at? To me! To me, men! Everybody! Oop, here we go. Oh no, riding skill too low! This one. Come on, go horse. Go! Yes! <laughs> you are a champion. Uh, you might not actually be a champion horse, but you're a champion in my heart. That's what matters. God damn. I'm just thinking though, once we start our own kingdom, if we go to war with like Drahara, what the fuck are we gonna do about that? If 3,600 troops come our way, what do we do against that when it's just us? 
Whoops, tell them to charge. Infantry, you can charge. What is it? Who are these guys that are considered infantry? Oh no, okay, they're cavalry. No, 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 yeah. For some reason, our, our master archers are considered infantry, which that is not something that we did. Definitely not something that we did. I think it's just, like, all the hired troops, for whatever reason, are considered infantry. Even the ones that have names like hired knight, hired cavalry. Even those guys consider themselves infantry for some reason, which is really weird in sieges. Because I'm like, these dudes are just here with arrows. They're even called master archers. They're not responding to my commands right now. Is this almost over? Fuck. Just about did it. Lost 24, though. Ugh. Ugh. Like I said, we're going through budget cuts. <laughs> we're outsourcing jobs. Instead of, uh, expensive Draken Ritters, we're cutting down to, uh... I don't know. Shit, I don't know. A couple peasants, maybe? <laughs> Would that be a, a worthy replacement? What did we lose here? Eight... Uh, it's pretty spread out. Five Draken Ritters. Six Priesters. One Dragoner. Or one Kaiserlich dragon or two regular dragoners. Okay, yeah, it was pretty spread out. For the amount of dudes we took out. When we didn't... It's, oh my god. Amir Leonidas. Is he supposed to look like Leonidas? Because I kind of see it. I feel like we almost have to kind of start... <sighs> capturing these lords. Tell you what, we can look at this dude. What is he? He's Marshall. This one's actually a good dude too. Alright, we're going to let him go. This dude's... He's good natured as well. Alright, well, hey, we got one Draken Ritter back. No, we actually don't have enough for all these dudes. Holy shit. Could be making some bank off of, uh... What is this worth? 19 grand. Son. Nephew. <laughs> what you doing? Alright. Looks good to me. Alright, we're pro <laughs> Look at this fucking army. Look at this army. What am I supposed to do with this? What am I supposed to do with this? What the hell, Kaiser Odo? You're getting rid of... You're getting rid of our lords? We can't afford to get rid of lords right now. Oh, hello, there's Sultan still in there. Alright, yeah, yeah, Olga, I'll come. I just... Things haven't been going too well for the Reich recently, if you haven't noticed. God damn, who's... Was this dude coming after us? 410, King Ingveld. Oh, shit. Okay, yeah. I guess I understand why he was coming after us. Herzog Oscar's at least up a little bit. Alright, th I'm gonna have to do some work in between episodes. I don't know what I'm gonna have to do. We gotta figure out some way to keep the, uh... Keep the Draharans away. I guess what we could do is just recruit, like... Like a thousand of those hired like archers or whatever because they're pretty cheap um, And just station them, but that would take a while because the dude only carries like a hundred at a time I don't know. We'll figure it out. So anyways, we're gonna go ahead and end off here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed We did get Skyfall. We didn't lose that many troops. We actually had some pretty sweet big battles this episode We're still making tons of money. In fact We're getting really damn close to that half a million mark which the goal is, the goal is 10 million. I think that's definitely going to be attainable. Definitely going to be attainable. Do we have, we have acres of land here? Yeah, we've got a bunch of acres of land here, so we're making money off of it. At some point, I'm going to have to go around the map and just, uh, and just get all of the, uh, land that's available. And see how much money we make doing that. So, until then, as always, guys, leave some comments down below. Let me know what you think about this series and all the rest of the series that we got going on right now. And as always, take it easy.